Hello, gamers of the Game Report. On my page, League of Legends Wiki dot com slash Wiki Champion, there is an unknown scale of a rework for Zillion. So this could include a gameplay rework and a visual rework. I have two pages that back me up on this by Riot uh, posting on their forums. And uh, as you see here, this is one of the people who worked at Riot. It even shows one of two Riot posts, 18 of 30. Uh, before I read these and go into detail of what the change will be, I'd like to discuss an RP contest right now because I love giving back to my subscribers and my people. So, gamers, all you guys have to do to enter to win is do these three things. Go follow the link in the description below. It will be my Twitch. It's twitch.tv slash thegameport. All you guys have to do is follow on there. I get notified every time you guys follow me. I love looking at it. As, uh, as you see, I have 17,000 emails, and it's really fun going through them. I'm not joking. I actually I go through them every day. I leave that tab open. As well, uh, all you guys have to do is leave a comment RP with your summoner name. This is open to all servers because I'm not going to discriminate against other servers um, like you all. If Because you, you guys don't get to choose what server. It's more what region you're from. It doesn't really matter. Uh, third thing is subscribe to the Gear Import 1. That's this channel. So just click that subscribe button on this video right now. And those are the three things. And you'll be entered to win. And I will announce the winner when this video reaches 2,000 comments. Which won't take very long to reach. Um, if you start asking is the contest over. I will sort of get annoyed because it happens quite a lot where you guys know when it'll end because I've, I've told you how it'll end so i will pm the winner because you guys have to leave a comment on the video anyways i'll have you uh, i'll have a way to contact you and that's how we'll do this now to go into detail medler writes on the forums replying to someone's quote so first i'll read the quote and then i'll write i'll read what he wrote so it has been two years and five months since he's gotten a skin after season one ended he has been one of the least popular champions to have graced the fields of justice since creation questions of him getting a visual upgrade update have been left unanswered not to mention with each new champion release he becomes more and more obscure right ever since march 2011 zillion has been my favorite champion i've spent months learning him and building different types of zillions whether it is the common AP Burst Zillion, the ever loved Support Zillion, or even Tank Zillion. I even com commissioned an artist to create my Eternum Zillion skin idea, which has been greatly loved by the community. I will defend Zillion till my last breath, but it, it, it isn't me. It isn't just me. There are hundreds of Zillion players on the forums that want answers. Most of us feel that Zillion has been completely and utterly forgotten by Riot. Can we please get any information on Zillion? It can be anything, really. Uh, a new possible skin, a visual update, or even a kit change. We understand that there are other champions that need your time, like Heimerdinger or Sivir, which both have gotten visual updates already now. Uh, this post was a little while ago. Uh, Mar mm. We are okay with waiting. It is just when we don't get any information, we get saddened. We know that since Morello said all global passives will be removed, Zillion will have to be looked at. But that begs the question, will you do anything besides change the passive? Sincerely, Madlock. Thank you for making him. Fair question. Zillion's a champ we've been pretty quiet about. He's someone we'd like to do some design side work on at some point for a couple of reasons. First off is that he's got a really cool concept, Time Mage, which is Kit doesn't explore as much as it should, as it could. Bonus XP on the passives, kind of useful and kind of thematic, for example. It's not all that exciting or engaging, though, so we'd like to explore things like that to see what more we could be doing to really dig into his theme background. Secondly, he's also got some gameplay issues it will be nice to address. No rank up, up damage, uh, scaling beyond level 9 for example makes his power curve tough to balance in a satisfying way for example. When we'll get a chance to take a crack at his gameplay however, however is a harder question to answer. He's a bit underappreciated has a few issues, isn't living up to his full potential, etc. But he's certainly not at all comparable to other contenders for design time like Poppy, Scion, or Yorick, which I all I have videos on every single one of them, and reasons why they are getting theirs first, who are higher priorities for us. Not certain what his timeline's like for visual improvements, and I guess the answer's probably pretty similar in that he's not in a Sivir or Yee-like state, so it would be nice to do some work on, but not a contender for a major upgrade in the short medium term. 
So this will take a few months, because uh, Hammerdinger took for freaking ever to come out. That's kind of disappointing, but what they plan for him, honestly, you guys will say, how do, you, how do you know this? It sounds like a buff. They're saying that his passive isn't useful enough, it's just getting experience. This one's going to be, if you are good with Zillion, you'll be able to use the passive. It'll actually be an ability, maybe. Where he then has five abilities, something else to change time, maybe, or to do something to speed someone up, etc. Maybe they move abilities around. But it sounds like they're gonna make his passive much better than it is right now. They will probably, like they've done with the past few champions, Master Yi, Sever, uh, Heimerdinger, they make them extremely strong and really usable. It's really quick to, to learn them too, because you've already played the old one, and it's not a huge change from it. They've just moved abilities around and then added a couple, or like changed the other ones and made them into different abilities. So, this is pretty exciting, personally. I think a zillion update is what he needs. So this isn't just a visual, this sounds like a both visual and gameplay. Uh, Grumpy Monkey has some ideas about Zillion. <laughs> uh, is that all? I want to know what you think about Zillion's design right now. Grumpy Monkey has some ideas about that. Okay, so that is amazing. I, <laughs> I personally just after reading that, I'm looking forward to what they are going to do with the Zillion rework. Um, it sounds incredible. I'd like you to leave some comments below of what you guys think about this rework. I'm definitely going to read them and reply to every single one of you. Um, I really look forward to your comments, and uh, I hope this champion rework comes out soon. It'll probably be a full rework, like visual and gameplay like they did to Master Yi. Just not urgent as hell, because he's technically still playable. You guys have seen early game Zillion with those time bombs. He's... He's doing a lot of damage. It's more the late game where if he doesn't build right, he's going to fall off a bit. He doesn't insta-kill someone. He's still so freaking strong late game. I'm not trying to hate against any of you main, people who main Zillion. He's scary. He can mid lane. He can, he can support. He can tank. It's, it's ridiculous what he can do. And if you manage his mana right, he will dominate a lane. But I think he'll be better. I think he will be. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to enter the contest. Don't forget to subscribe if you didn't already. Leave a like if you liked the video. And I'll keep doing more videos like this if I see a good turnout.